What is up? Good morning, everybody. everybody. Boy, I think we're a little bit more chipper than we were yesterday. Yeah, uh, she only got up 12, 15, 144, 3.36, and like 5 a.m. And I, I remember none of it. So, <laughs> at 2.44, or whatever I just said, <laughs> she was screaming in her kennel at the top of her lungs. And I'm laying in bed and my heart opens because it hurts. Like you just want to comfort them. And so my heart, I'm like, come on, baby, please just. And in one ear, all I hear is, yeah, 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 yeah. And in the other ear, all I hear is. <laughs> I don't snore like that. Come on. In the other ear, all I heard was. <laughs> <laughs> so needless to say, our little girl is good. We are good. Today is a good brand new day. Every day is a good day. It Here is. we go. But today, Dustin and I have work to do. And um, it's Saturday. It is. I know. We get it. We do. And, you know, usually there's one day out of the week that we really sit down and finish everything up that we need to get finished. Yeah. Um, currently, our little girl is sleeping in her kennel. Don't hit me. Okay. Currently, our little girl is sleeping. Currently, our little girl is sleeping in her kennel, and we're going to let her sleep yes. for just a little bit. Shh. Um, there's really not a whole lot that we can film for you today as we are going to be working. So we wanted to actually share with you what exactly it is that we do when we say we have work to do. Yeah, a lot of people have questioned, a lot of people ask, we're not going to get into what we do to make money, we're not going to get into blah, 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 blah. We're going to get into the things that we focus on mm -hmm. and the things that we work on, on a daily slash weekly basis. For sure. So let's get started. So number one thing on our list is video editing. We have, if you've been paying attention and following along, we've been dropping new vlogs every day ever since we got Journey. Um, but before that, we dropped new vlogs every Sunday for like the last a year. year. Yeah. So we do a lot of not only video editing, but we do a lot of filming, a lot of videoing, a lot of photos, a lot of different aspects, a lot of different things to show people how we mm -hmm. live. So after we're done videoing and filming and taking the things and doing all the stuff, Tanya does the video editing. For sure. And right now is a really good time because it's allowing me to brush up on my skills a little bit, a little bit better and being consistent with my video editing. But not only do we do video editing for us, we also do video editing for small businesses. So things that we have done as we have small businesses send us some video footage and we piece it together usually to do about a one minute introduction video to their business that just kind of displays what the type of work that they do and that way they can post it on social media as most of the platforms only allow you about a minute to really showcase a video. Sure. And people like there's a book called the purple cow or something like mm -hmm. that and people want to stand out especially in today's day and age where everybody's trying to get into the online game mm -hmm. because businesses are closed down and people are at home so in a way that we have shown and been able to help people get in front of more people and mm -hmm. showcase what it is they do mm -hmm. she makes some rad one minute videos of exactly what it is that they do mm -hmm. on top of that we add together 30 hashtags which is the most that instagram will allow Wow. Mm -hmm. So we give them a hashtag pack that's specific to them and their business so that they get the most views, the most in, in, uh, in, uh, the, the most uh, integration, the most love and support that they mm -hmm. can from one video, as well as we put music to it, the whole video with mm -hmm. the hashtag pack, and we give that to that business owner. It's theirs. We use it some as advertisement, mm -hmm. but it's their video when we are all done and they can use it however they want, as many times as they want. And it's a really good way to get in front of your people, your uh, following, your avatar and show them what it is that they do. Absolutely. And also with that comes with creating. So a lot of the things that we do is graphic design. Um, so on top of those, 
video packages that we send out to these small businesses, we also put together a customized thumbnail. So that way, if they want to post that on a YouTube channel to display it or to showcase the video and it just kind of gives a brief little overview of what that business is, we put together a thumbnail for them. And then also with graphic design, we are doing book covers for um, authors. So when they write a book and they want their book to be published, we put together a front and back cover for that book for that person so it gives them exactly what it is that they're looking for to showcase their um, book. book yeah and along with the graphic design we've made logos mm -hmm. she's actually working on three different sets of stickers for us right now for our bus because that's Gooly palooza we ran out mm -hmm. and we like giving people stickers and, and and trading stickers with other people so there's tons of things that tanya does with graphic design she's our artist she's mm -hmm. our designer she creates on that platform mm -hmm. and she does really good at it for sure one of the other things that we have which is our actual business is Dustin and I run a nutrition and fitness company um, where we teach people how to live healthy. Yeah, for sure. So we do everything from, we have a closed Facebook group that we do live Zoom calls on every Wednesday. We make meal plans and help people realize what it is they need to eat, how much they need to eat, and truly start to figure out how to live a healthy lifestyle. So, do you like beer and nachos? Because I do. So I assure you, I'll have some beers and I'll have some nachos. But in the meantime, I'll also watch the other things that I eat. I remain in the whole food sector. I try to drink mostly water. I try to sleep as much as I can, get as much sun, and I try to exercise every day, which allows me once in a while to indulge on things like beer and pizza. Or if we go to a birthday, I can assure you, I'm having birthday cake. <laughs> but that's what we try to teach people, teach them the habits to actually learn how to eat. Mm -hmm. Instead of fad diets or crash diets where you might lose 20 or 30 pounds, this one, you can lose 20 or 30 pounds, continue on your weight loss goals, and continue to make it a healthy lifestyle. That's the ticket. For sure. And for some people who need a little bit more assistance with what to eat, like you said, we have customizable meal plans. So we completely take the guesswork out of it for you and show you exactly what to eat and how to eat it. That way you can truly live your life eating the things that you enjoy and not having to have any restrictions. On top of that, we also can do workout plans, fitness ideas, indoors, outdoors, gym, no gym. We do it all for our clients and help them truly embrace a healthy lifestyle. When we also started our Black and Camo Boot Camp, where we can provide live videos of workouts that you can do in the comfort of your own home or outdoors. Him and I are mostly doing them outdoors. And we do those videos live every day, Monday through Friday at 11 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. Also, if you're not able to make it live, we do post them on YouTube so you can catch them at a later date whenever it's convenient for you. And if it's something you would like to catch live, find us at Happy Healthy Fun on Instagram mm -hmm. or on Facebook. Instagram, we just put up the workout. Facebook is where we go live at. You can find us there Monday through Friday, 11 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. And I can assure you we're gonna sweat. It's going to be fast, like, you know, usually around 20, 30 minutes, we're done. It mm -hmm. takes no equipment. We all join together. Everybody jumps in, does a workout, and we hit the ground running. For sure. But we also have wrote a book. We did. We wrote a book on how to live a healthy lifestyle, and it's called exactly that, How to Live a Healthy Lifestyle. And you can find that on Amazon. I will post the link in the description below so you can find it if it's something that you're looking forward to. Bing! Everybody always does that. Sure. I just wanted to do it. Okay. All right. Another thing that we do is write articles. Not only for our nutrition and fitness company do we do blog posts. Not only for Road Trip Adventure do we do blog posts. Not only for Happy Healthy Fun do we write blog posts. And for our personal social media pages, mm -hmm. we do, I guess what you would call blog posts, our posts, whatever you want to call them, mm -hmm. we write them. But on occasion, people reach out to us either through bus life or nutrition and fitness or, or travel. travel or whatever and ask 
just to write a piece for an article that they are part of and so that we can add our two cents. And actually today I have to write an article for how the COVID-19 has affected our bus life. For sure. So I look forward to writing that, but that is usually a weekly thing where we're writing some article, some form or another of a post, a blog or an article. For sure. And recently we just started our first podcast. And this is a podcast that we share with you our story. We get real, we get raw, and we dive deep into relationships, into expansion, into healthy living, all of the things. And we will be dropping those every Saturday. Morning. Morning. So everybody can get their cartoons on as in the adult <laughs> world is what we like to call it. For sure. But with that, not only are we doing our own podcast, but we've had several people reach out to us and ask them to be ask us to be on their podcast. Mm -hmm. So we have been on several podcasts and they are very helpful in mm -hmm. us getting our word out, what we believe in and how we do things and hopefully we're helping other people do that as well. 100%. So if there's a podcast you think we need to be on, let, let us, us know. know. If there's something you would like us to do a podcast on, let, let us, us know. know. <laughs> um, also, recently we have been doing some bus building. Um, as Dustin and I started traveling full time in this bus in January, we have recently, and I should say mostly Dustin. Yeah, she does the design, I do the build, if yes. that makes sense. <laughs> I am creative in a different form. I know how to weld, I know how to build, I know how to create things differently. I took pallets and turned them into cabinet doors. We took this and made it into that, whatever, whatever. That's the things that I see in my head. I cannot draw a straight <laughs> a stick figure if I had to. And she knows that's why yeah. she's laughing. It's not my jam, but I, I'm creative in my own way. So not only have we b finished basically our bus, mm -hmm. but we helped build ZEP3 for Chris at the Off Grid Schoolie and Wes at the Transcend Existence. But we also helped both of them also do a roof raise in California on a full-size bus. And the three of us work incredibly well together. For it's sure. super fun when we're all together, everybody's having fun and we are getting the work done. But it's nice because we're all like-minded and we all have tools and assets and, and value that we bring to the table. And so helping build buses or building buses on my own has been a really good blessing. Um, I've worked on cars and motorcycles and lowrider bicycles and skateboards and rollerblades and all of the things the entire time growing up my whole life. And so in my adult life, building what we like to call hot rod homes is actually pretty <laughs> awesome. For sure. And lastly, a new task or job, if you will, that we have taken on is 24-7, <laughs> 365. Being dog parents. And it is the best job in the world, and I am so proud. No matter so if we happy. have split lips, <laughs> or no, if we're no, so tired, no sleep, exhaustion, whatever, we are so grateful to have mm -hmm. added our pretty little girl to our family, to our lives. And actually, tomorrow, we're going to take a family picture for Nuzzles, Nuzzles and & Co., Co., the company that we rescued our baby girl from. They want a picture of our family, so we're going to give them a picture of us and her with the bus mm -hmm. so that everybody can see just how awesome we are. For sure. So with that, it's time for us to get to work. We have a lot on our plate today, but we wanted to share this with you. If you know of anybody who can find this stuff helpful, or if you find this helpful, let us know or pass it on to somebody who could benefit from it. We're truly out here to help anybody and everybody in any way that we can. Don't be afraid to message us. Don't be afraid to, yeah, reach out. Mm -hmm. However you see fit, we would love to help or see if we could help at least point you in the right direction. For sure. So with that, it's time to get to work. Spread love. Bye, guys.